because it's not done yet. But this right here equals two hundred dollars, and that will get us floor sander and belts, uh, rental and all that. And I have the pieces, and you might be surprised to know that each piece is only worth five dollars and seventy-one cents. Everybody can afford five dollars and seventy-one cents. It'll only take thirty-five people to fill this puzzle. So. I'm going to have these puzzle pieces and I'm going to be walking around so yeah. you can take a puzzle piece and turn your money in and when this is filled, we can continue finishing our floor. It's a good idea, right? <laughs> and if you don't have 571 and you just have 6, that's okay. We'll <laughs> okay. Also, I have this bigger puzzle which is really fun to put together and inside of it, each of these pieces has one of the needs of word players on it. Um, and it goes anywhere from the small thing like CD player or CDs or something like that, popcorn machine. Yeah. <laughs> oh, you like that popcorn? All the way up to you know, in the paper bags. Um, all the way up to things like a table saw and stuff like that. And also, there are five pieces in here, which I would love to see. If nothing else goes tonight, I would love to see these five pieces gone, which say, I will clean the theater twice a month for one month. And it starts in April. If five people take those pieces, we're, we're good all the way through August with cleaning. That's not hard to do. So please, if you like to clean, take these puzzle pieces. Dig through here and see what you can find that you can take and purchase. Then you can bring the puzzle piece back and we'll put it on the wall and eventually we'll have a completed puzzle and all these needs will be met. 48 needs of words players right here. Easy. If everybody pitches in and takes part, we'll be good. And I'm supposed to talk about Saturday, which is tomorrow. There's a work day here and I was here last Saturday and we were getting dirty and playing on this floor here and it was good, solid, fun getting dirty and it went stuff. Um, but there's a small group of people that were here, to be honest. So if you can come on Saturday and work and get this place in order, we would really appreciate it, even if you can just come for a little while. It, everything helps. So come in and jump in and we'll get to work. Okay? Don't just listen to me. Just do it. <laughs> 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 no slap. <laughs> well, that's, that's what's fun about slaps. You can slap. <laughs> Good slappy walk. It is not yet a near day. It was the light in there, not the log that pierced the fearful hollow of thine ear. Nightly she sings like on the pomegranate tree. It was the law. Step on my foot. <laughs> <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
Double preparation. <laughs> Are you, do you know that meeting going on? Uh -huh. Are you going? Uh -huh. <laughs> All employees, please report to the conference room. <laughs> <laughs> Focus on the speaker, please. Greetings <laughs> 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 to one and all. We have been required by the government to give a safety debrief. debrief. <laughs> so first of all, in the case of fire, we will hence exit to the left. In the case of a tornado, we will take the stairs down to the basement and escape thereby into the basement. <laughs> 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 and there have to find our safety. In the case of a flood, we will take the same precautions as it were in the case of a tornado, which is not at all taking the stairs down into the basement. Thank you for your time. That was helpful. No. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> man, man, tuna. Man, tuna. Man, tuna. Man, tuna. Man, tuna.
up here to do something. Uh, something about Vienna. Uh, <laughs> 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 Mr. Stutz! Mr. Stutz! <laughs> Mr. Stutz.
Yeah. <laughs>
Thank <laughs> you.